Okay. This had to be said because, wow. Just wow. I was hoping someone would get the hint and get the message, but apparently not. Some jackass decided it was cute to try to frame me as being a Reddit account owner, which is pretty fucking stupid because, one, I don't promote any Reddit account. I mean, what's the point of promoting something you don't own? And it's especially stupid because of a couple nitpicky situations, right? And I want to make this perfectly clear. Uh, this comment was posted on the highlight where I defend Shugga Conroy from blatantly false accusations. Convenient, isn't it? Yeah! On a video, or rather highlight, I defend Shugga Conroy from blatantly false accusations. Hmm... <laughs> the specific video where the uh, comment happened was highlight. I truly believe Chuck O'Connor is innocent of what he's accused of, for context. You can read the uh, comment thread, which this guy calls more and more insane and more and more idiotic. But, this guy brings up a couple of weird subreddits for whatever reason exists. And if, if that's your thing, that's your thing. Personally, I find it weird, but if, if that's what you're into, you do you, boo. <coughs> <coughs> but, this guy brings up a few... Interest in hobbies, which is grasping at straws. I personally avoid Reddit like the fucking plague because of how toxic it is. I was in a chat with a couple of friends on Discord, a voice chat, where we've gone over in what ways Reddit is a toxic environment. Like, you say something that people don't agree with on there, and they dogpedal you and shit like that. Yeah. Um, granted, that happens on Facebook and, uh, Twitter, too. But it's not nearly as bad as Reddit. Or, as, <clears throat> another friend of mine put it, not as toxic as 4chan. Another place I avoid, like, the plague. Well, Reddit and 4chan both have their reputations... For honestly good reasons. And only reason I would know about Reddit is because I've watched a few videos going over the website. And how toxic people can be in general on there. I um, wanted to say, if memory serves, r slash has gone over the toxic environment on uh, Reddit once or twice. I know Upper Echelon Gaming has done it. I'm, I'm going to say Rapsion before he decided, you know, I, I, he should uh, focus on his family, which I find laudable. Honestly, I find that very respectable. I believe he's also gone over how um, toxic Reddit is, which I agree. That's kind of why I stay off that web website. But, <clears throat> <clears throat> he's thrown in an obsession over a Splatoon. Which is an incredibly stupid point to make because, well, over a thousand, maybe 17,000 players play on a daily basis. Dude, you gotta come up with a lot better than that if you're gonna try to frame someone for owning a Reddit account on a bunch of weird subreddits. Moving on, also, actually, before we move on, 
I need to address something here right quick, and that's my model. The species is that of an inkling, which is, you know, the, your main avatar in Splatoon. But, <coughs> <coughs> there's more to that than just Splatoon. You see the weapon that is on my back there? That is the Monado. And let me just flip myself over here real quick. Flip, it flip myself over. Yeah, that is the Monado in its suppressed state. I.e. when it's in shackles. That is from an action JRPG game called Xenoblade Chronicles. Which, I'm going to come out right now and say action is nowhere near as good as uh, <coughs> turn-based. But, Xenoblade is still a pretty good game for those who haven't played it. Seriously, check it out. I highly recommend it. Not as much as Persona, mind you, but still. It is a good game in its own right. Lastly, you can kind of see my uniform, what I'm wearing. This is the uniform of a Deodyne Shock Trooper. <coughs> Which is, of course, Perfect Dark. That's where my username came from. On YouTube, anyway. And that's where my gamer tag came from. Data Dine Captain. Which was going to be Data Dine Executive. But too many characters for Xbox, so that couldn't have happened. So I was just stuck with it for my YouTube channel. And my kick account. And my Discord. Not for my Patreon, because I want that to reflect my game company, Moon Enigma. Something you conveniently left out. It's clear, you do not pay attention to my channel. Sorry for that beat, by the way. It's that stupid uh, smoke detector, which the manager's truck and their feet fixing. That's neither here nor there right now. On to the main point, though. It's clear you do not pay attention to my channel. I promote every social media that I use. In order... <coughs> I am most active on YouTube. Hell, YouTube is what I use to sleep to in the background. I'm not the only one, so don't even try to pull that card. Like, oh, it's weird to sleep with YouTube. A lot of people sleep with background noise. It's a lot more common than you think. Second most common platform I use is Twitch. A lot of my friends use Twitch to stream. A lot of people I know go to Twitch to support their favorite content creators. Hell, Raging Golden Eagle uses Twitch. <coughs> Granted, I don't watch him nearly as much as I should, but hey, you know, it, it is what it is. Then again, we all tend to keep busy lives. Hell, I have my own live streams to upkeep. My third, most frequently, and by extension, the middle of the road, Twitter. Which, fun fact, when Meverse, that logo that you see on my chest there, yeah, uh, in the Perfect Dark, that's where the Data Dine logo would go. But I wanted it to reflect on my Twitch username, Carl's TCB Meverse. So uh, there it is. That's the Meverse logo. Which I still pray that um, Nintendo realizes. You know, we had something going on with Meverse. 
Why don't we bring it back for the next console? Yay! Miiverse was the sole reason I was rarely around Twitter. <coughs> Only reason I'm active on Twitter is because I'm basically forced to be. To get literally anywhere. So that's kind of the only reason why I use Twitter. That and despite the left, who is majorly attacking Elon Musk. That's the only reason why I'm paying for Twitter Blue. The fourth most frequent of my socials is my Discord, which I'm not even on all that often. <laughs> I don't even update my own server all that often. So, uh, there's that. <coughs> <coughs> and the bottom of the barrel, the one I tend to be least active on. Well, the only reason I have any presence on there is to diversify where I stream to. And that is Kick. K I C K, Kick. It's an alternative to Twitch, and if I can actually get a view base over there, I'd be more often streaming on Kick and less on Twitch. But until then, I'm keeping Twitch on the table. I'm already an affiliate on uh, Twitch, so that's also um, another reason. So there it is. The socials that I tend to be active on and actually use. So to keep insisting I go oh, he uses Reddit. If I don't promote it, I don't use it. It's really that simple. And for you continuously grasp at straws to try to frame me as the um, account owner on Reddit. It's pretty sound pathetic. And you also, don't even bot, and I shouldn't even have to say this. <clears throat> you don't even bother mentioning what the um, account name is. I have two usernames that I use on YouTube, Kick, and Discord. I call Discord Discord because it fucks up a lot. I should probably explain that. And there's my Twitch username. <coughs> All you say is your exact username. Which one? Data9 Executive or Klaus TCB Meverse? I use both. And only on the socials that I mentioned. So which one did you see? Which account name did you see on Reddit? And for everyone else, if you see either of those usernames on Reddit, report that account. Report it and just don't interact with that account whatsoever. Whoever it is that is running that account, that's not me. So report it, don't interact with it, Nothing. I honestly didn't think, as small as I am, I'd have to worry about posers, but lo and behold, here we are. Then again, I've seen smaller accounts get the imposter syndrome, so really, why am I surprised? Anyway, that's... Really, all I have to say about this issue, about that, of course, it wouldn't be a me video without tripping on my words at the end. That's all I had to say about the situation, and honestly, regardless of which um, username you see, if it's Data and Executive or Klaus TCB Meverse, if you see either of those usernames on Reddit, just report the account and don't interact with it. Like, that's not me on the um, website, 
Because, personally, it's too toxic for me to even be around. Yes, Twitter is also toxic, but it's... To be fair, it's not as bad as Reddit or 4chan. And, out of moral obligation, I do use Twitter to out of spite against the left because they are trying to ruthlessly destroy Elon Musk because he will not placate to the mob. Like, not much I respect Elon Musk for. <laughs> That's why I paid for Twitter Blue! <sighs> anyway, thank you for listening to this video. Thank you for listening to what I had to say and think before you try to tie someone to an account they don't have.